if you have a limit that goes to infinity or a limit as x approaches infinity of a rational function, which is a function that's a fraction with variables in the denominator and also possibly in the numerator, then divide both the numerator and the denominator by the order of the denominator. So here the order of the denominator is, is 3. 3 also happens to be the order of the numerator. So let's multiply 1 over x cubed by the numerator and denominator. The square root of 1 over x to the 6th is the same thing as 1 over x cubed. So let's multiply the square root of 1 over x to the 6th times the numerator. Okay, now let's plug in infinity. So 2 over infinity goes to 0. 0 minus 1, the denominator goes to minus 1. 1 over infinity goes to 0 plus 4. The square root of 4 is 2, so the numerator goes to 2. 2 divided by minus 1 is minus 2. So this limit is equal to minus 2. 